Hello, everybody. Welcome back. We have a Wilds of Eldraine Collector Booster box. I believe all of the Collector Boosters are made in the same place, which is Japan in this instance. So, uh, another set of Japanese cards, which means the rares will be in the front. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start cracking. Um, there are a whole cycle of uh, Enchanting Tales cards um, in these. So there's a there's a few pulls you can get. I think there's some guaranteed um, some guaranteed uncommons, but then uh, there's obviously there's a chance for rare and mythic ones, and then there's some anime ones potentially, and some confetti foil um, hopefully anime cards <laughs> potentially. I do love the collector boosters. They they even make the booster packs look really nice. Um, but yeah, these are these are the Japanese ones. They do have pull tabs. I'm going to try and just open these. Sometimes, you know, collector boosters can be notoriously difficult to open. And, yeah. Yeah, I'll go ahead and... I'll, I'll just, oh. yeah, I'll slice the top off. Um, I'm being careful. They're my packs. I can do what I want with them <laughs> before everyone starts to comment. We do appreciate comments, but, uh, you know, they're my, my packs. Double-sided tokens, and then our extended art rare is the Iron Crag, so two mana mana rock. There's our ley line of sanct sanctity. I'll just keep these together. White, um, the white virtue. Um, so that's there's a whole cycle of these, one in each color. Um, yeah, so th this one's you know pretty solid. You can kind of make some creatures at the start. And then, uh, and then pump them. Ox Drover, so this is going to be the commander card from the set. Feral Encounter. It's a good fight spell, finds you some action. And then here are some additional uncommon. Uh, <laughs> of course, they, they love doing this, just double hit. And then our Full Art Lands. Discerning Financier. Picklock Prankster. And we'll we'll just go through the uh, the commons really quick. So the Iron Crag uh, definitely could be a good card. Um, looks interesting with the uh, the sword up on top of the rock, but you know two mana two mana mana rocks um, actually pretty good. Yeah, we'll keep going here. And yes, I'm making sure that the cards are near the bottom of the pack so I don't slice the top off of one of them. We haven't sliced one yet, knock on whatever this yeah. table's made out of. Yep, so Polluted Bonds. So this is one of the, uh, the, uh, oh, the Enchanting Tales cards. Is it? Yeah, because it has a different symbol, right? Yeah. Yes, it is. Enchanting Tales. So, oh, right, and it's also WOT. So... Our, our rare um, special art card is the Enchanting Tale. So is this, Frank Sanity, Bramble Familiar. Beseech the Mirror. So this one, you know, people are speculating on it. It's a tutor that you can kind of um, get something and immediately cast it if you bargain. So that's interesting. Raging Battle Mouse. Impact Tremors for our Enchanting Tale Uncommons. Swamp. I do like that at least the the you know the the land is guaranteed to be uh, full art and collector boosters because you know this is one of those sets that you know in the uh, in the booster it's not uh, in like draft boosters it's only like one in three or something is actually a full art so then you get all the the old school looking lands that I'm not a fan of food token fairy on the back tangled colony. Nature's Will, Gumdrop Provisioner. Oh, I have not seen that artwork of it, and that is honestly pretty horrifying. Like, you know, she's got, like, candy canes for arms. Uh, wow, yeah, that's that's something. Misleading Signpost for a Commander card. Yenna Redtooth Regent, Curiosity. Hatchling Plans, ooh, that looks cool. A foil Island. Archive Dragon. Ooh, the Tempting Apple. That looks really cool in foil. The purple, like, flame mm -hmm. stuff around the, around it. Yeah. Water Wings. 
Yeah, so collector boosters definitely fun to open. You know, even even the commons that aren't worth anything, you know, the overprinted foils and everything, they look great. And uh, sometimes, you know, you just have this card that happens to work really well in your deck. And uh, it's good to get a foil copy of it. Ooh, Restless Biovac. Biovac? I'm sure I butchered that. Either way, uh, Borderless Foil, and you know what? It looks pretty great for a rare land cycle. Hardened Scales, like kind of a snake. That, I, like, I do like that art. Um, looks pretty cool. A Restless Cottage. Okay, so we got another Borderless Land, non-foil. There's our Commander card, Regal Bunnicorn. Grasp of Fate. You know, I thought we were going to get another Grasp of Fate for a second. <laughs> Mountain. Twisted Fealty, Stroke of Midnight. Oh, Stroke of Midnight. I don't know. I'm kind of speculating on this card. Uncommon. Might be a good foil to have. Maybe that turns into Commander Staple. It hits anything but lands. All right. Four down, eight to go. Seems all right so far. Uh, would really like to see some anime cards. Or an Ashiok. Yeah, or Ashiok. Another, the only Planeswalker in the set. Ooh, that dragon looks cool. Yeah, Realm Scorcher. Okay, the Nightmare token looks cool too. Yeah, flames look great in foil. They really do. Yeah. Mana Flare. Kellen the Fey Bonded. Fey Blooded, uh, actually. If I read correctly. And it's a Mythic. Imodane the Pyre Hammer, another foil mythic, Agatha's Soul Cauldron, Dragon Mantle, Raid Bombardment, and there's that cool island again, Ash, Eerie Interference, there's our uncommons and our commons. The colors on the full art lands in this set are really like vibrant. Yes. The green is really bright, the blue is really bright. Yep, they're, they, yeah, they do look, look very nice. Um, I don't know if it's just Japanese printers. I know we kind of say it a lot. And also, it looks like every one of the tokens is a food, at least on the back. Um, that treasure looks cool, too. Oppression. Karmic Justice. So there's an anime card. Yeah, it looks nice. So it's a rare. Horn Locked Whale. Horned Lock Whale. Food Fight. This is an interesting card. You need... Um, yeah, one plus number of permanents named Food Fight you control. So it's like, I don't, you know, it's a rare. I don't know if that's going to end up being really a thing. Stab Wound and Compulsion. And then I think that's the first planes, Tattered Ratter. I like saying that. Mm -hmm. Tattered Ratter. Tattered Ratter. All right, halfway, halfway through, we got one of the anime cards so far, so hopefully we can keep those going. Yep, food token. I kind of wish they would put, you know, the other side of the card. You know, if they're all going to be food on one side. I don't know if that's the case yet, but obviously we're 7 for 7. Sneak Attack, there's another anime, anime card. Mythic too. Yeah, that's a good one. Sneak Attack, you know, lets you cheat things out. Restless Biovac again, this time non-foil. Song of Totentons. Hilda's Crown, Utopia Sprawl, and Dragon Mantle Mountain. And I don't know. Maybe this ends up turning into a thing. You know, it's a red creature. It's uncommon, and it's two. Uh, it's a one drop with two power. Um, it doesn't have haste, but you know, Mono Red loves those things. Quick Study. You know, this is uh, instant three mana. Two, you know, draw two cards. So there. Slowly power creeping the, the draw spells in uh, in standard limited. Alrighty. Twinning twins in the uh, storybook art. Oversold cemetery. Uh, actually, that art looks just great. I man, I'd like to see that in foil. Um, you know, that just got a print in uh, Dominary Remastered. Actually, this is another one I'd like to see in foil. Scalding Viper. Um, you know, just like kind of a red burn, aggressive thing. Expel the Interlopers. Is the Biobox promo. 
that you can do through stores. There's a, one of the land cycle. Hatching plans and stab wound. Oh, we finally get to see the forest. Um, so it, it is kind of dark, but in the right light, it, it really pops. That green, you know, just looks really good. Uh, pairs with the storybook art, Ashiok's Reaper. Now, can we get an Ashiok to go along with uh, Ashiok's Reaper? Torch the Tower. Titanic Growth. All right, two-thirds of the way done. Four packs to go. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we got two anime cards so far. Sneak Attack's really good. Um... And there, there's still some some bangers for uh, for the uh, reprint cards. There's Frank Sanity and Forced Fruition. That player's draw seven cards. Oh, that's very interesting. <laughs> um, that's kind of like for the group hug type decks. Heart Flame Duelist. I haven't seen this art for it yet. But I it's bet cool in card. foil the swords really pop out. Oh, they're you're so probably bright. right. Yeah. Giant Inheritance, that's going to be our commander card. Archon of the Wild Rose. Definitely a good card. You know, uh, auras aren't really a thing, but they are in this set, and this really is a payoff for them. Raid Bombardment, Impact Tremors, Island, which is Vanity. Yeah. But, you know, these cards, the quality on them seems really great. Like... The foils look good. The coloring looks good on the foils. And well, I mean, coloring looks good on everything, uh, at least that I've seen. Food and Rowan. Is that Sayonara. an anime card too, or? Uh, I don't believe this counts as anime because the animation only be like it kind of looks like it. It's kind of a flat art style, uh, but it is a mythic. It, you know, three mana, four two with menace, primal vigor. Oh, this is kind of... I think this is like the villain of the set. Ariette of the Charmed Apple. Um, I haven't seen this art of her yet. Uh, but another mythic. That's cool. Fawn's Bane Troll. Pollen Shield Hair. Season of Growth and Dark Tutelage. Plains Casket. Rage. Ooh, actually, I did want to look at this card in foil. Yeah, and, I did too, because this You know, like, as I yeah. thought, you know, some of these cards I just have to stop and look at, because... I mean, honestly, if you look at a lot of them, they look great. Glass Casket's another one of them. Evolving Wilds. Yeah, but I don't know. Something about flames or uh, or like the apple card with like kind of the purpley flames the going on the apple. The colors really pop out. Yep. Foils. All right, two packs left to go. What do we have? We have an, oh, oh, I did want to see that in foil. So Oversold Cemetery in foil. It does look pretty cool. Really accents the uh, you know that that contrast. Omniscience. That's a cool version of it. Tegwell, Duke of Splendor, for a mythic extended art commander card. And in foil, I don't believe this slot is guaranteed foil. Beseech the Mirror, that tutor card in foil. Griffin, Airy, and Curiosity. Forest. Bitter Chill. Alright, one pack left to go. Would really like to see an Ashiok. Would really like to see another uh, another uh, anime card if we can get one. Um, Confetti foil. Just some, some new rares that we haven't seen would be great. Raging Battle Mouse. Not quite it. Sanguine Bond. That's good. Um, I don't know if there's a... I, you know, it's a different art style for it, and it's borderless. I do like it. Restless Vine Stock, borderless. Ingenious Prodigy. Rankle's Prank. Prankle, Dark Tutelage, Season of Growth. Planes. Well, that's going to do her. We have, you know, uncommons left to go. Um, but, yeah, it's I still, you know, regardless of what we open, end up having fun opening the boxes. And we'll see what some of these cards do um, over time. And uh, you can see our collection of food tokens. And anyway, thank everyone for joining. Um, please like, subscribe, or comment. And uh, please keep watching the videos. We appreciate all of it. Thank you all. Have fun opening your packs. Have, hopefully everyone uh, does some pre-releases. And uh, yeah, thank you. Out. Thank you.